Hi guys, in this video I've explained uh, how you can make use of the Windows 8 Sync feature which works across PCs, tablets and also it's supposed to be across mobiles. Well, it's not surprising because it's a live account, it's a live service which is working on the background but it's pretty amazing because this is the first time Windows is having this feature by default. So what I've done now here is I've logged on to one computer with my Windows Live ID and I'm just going to change a uh, my user profile so I'll just put up a picture which I took it through the camera if you have webcam you can do that that's another cool feature it was not there before and these are the sync PC settings so you can choose between what you can choose and what you cannot choose to sync across like you can uh, sync across your favorites bookmarks passwords app settings and so many things which actually eliminates a lot of software that uh, we are doing that but we'll see how it goes with the metro ui in future so i'll just go and change the background and the user profile here changing couple of them so there's a user profile i can use a webcam oh sorry about that picture it's pretty annoying so i'm changing my uh, user profile and actually if you have connected your windows phone with this uh, you will see the win this very similar photo appearing in your windows phone also because it's connected with windows live so not a biggie but doing it across pc is cool with its inbuilt feature now i'm going to the desktop and i'll just change the wallpaper uh, the development version doesn't have a lot of wallpaper or theme so i had to choose whatever it was there not much like you can see i was lucky to get this one picture i guess yep the two wallpaper i selected this one probably this is the new window that wallpaper it's removing the xp thing so there you go i've changed the wallpaper and the user profile and now i'll switch to another computer that's uh, i'm running on virtual machine so here now i will log in it doesn't sync uh, very fast, it doesn't sync quickly, that I'm very sure of as of now, at least in the developer version. But um, probably if you have a faster bandwidth or something like that, maybe you can switch it off, switch very fast. So we'll just go to the user profile, change user tile. The change user tile is just the change profile picture. Like you can see now, um, my profile picture has appeared over there. So it, it takes a bit of time to do that. And uh, next, I will switch to see if a background has appeared or not. It takes a bit of time, uh, depending on the size of your wallpaper, size of your picture, whatever it is. So, we'll go to most settings, personalize. Uh, I also change the use it, uh, not use it, but the lock screen also, but it didn't appear at all. So, there you go, the windows. Uh, I've got the wallpaper also now. So that's how the sync works, a really cool feature, I hope you will use it, thanks for watching.